Look, one game is not going to erase or ease the pain of the Patriots dominance over the Bills for the last 20 years, but it could symbolize a start in the changing of the guard in the AFC East. But don't tell that to Sean McDermott because he wasn't having any of that conversation today. Uh, we're focused on one game right now. I uh, appreciate that. We're focused on one game. We're in October, late October, early November. And and that's really what we're focused on right now. Okay, so McDermott was using his coaching cliches, but Josh Allen would be honest about how important this week is, right? Well, it's it's the most important game um, because it's the next one. All right, maybe not, but leave it to the longest tenured Bills player to be honest about what beating the Patriots would mean to this organization. Oh, I think it's huge. Yeah, but Jerry Hughes knows better than to give the Patriots any bulletin board material when it comes to that changing of the guard talk. So until someone takes that crown from them, we cannot yet to say that. So I'm going to hold my tongue because I know I don't like to put anything out there in the universe and then have to come back and, uh, you know, eat crow. So I will say that we're going to we're going to be ready for this game. Now, McDermott is 0 and 6 in his head coaching career against Bill Belichick and New England. And when asked if Sunday's game had any extra meaning because it was against the Patriots, McDermott sounded like, well, Belichick saying that it's the next game on their schedule and that all games are important. Reporting with the Bills in Orchard Park, Dan Fates, 13 Wham Sports.